Hey, Shad here with Speed Axe, the fast growing gear site on the web. And today we're gonna uncreate the Scorpion Exomorpheus jacket. All right, Speed Addicts family, before we jump in and give you the full rundown on the Scorpion Exomorpheus jacket, I'm gonna ask you to do me a favor and subscribe. That helps us keep bringing you the best gear reviews in the universe. And at any point you decide, hey, I'd like to purchase one of those Scorpion Exomorpheus jackets from those guys over at speedaddicts.com, that'd be rad as well. We'll make it real easy. There's a link in the description below to shop for this jacket I'm wearing or any other parts or gear you might need for your next two wheel adventure. So Scorpion Exo has made a reversible riding jacket. I call it the bank robber special. You can got, get the flannel look on the outside and then it's totally reversible with more of a members only uh, feel and look with the polyester exterior that blocks the wind and water a little bit better. So two jackets for the price of one, you're gonna pay about $160 to get yourself one of these Morpheus jackets. Size range is nice and wide. It comes in one colorway, the one I'm wearing by the way. You're gonna see sizes small all the way up through 5XL. So they got everyone covered. I'm a 44 inch chest, weighing in about 220 pounds, 6'2". I'm wearing the large. This is cut a little bit more generous than say the covert, uh, the standard covert flannel. Uh, I feel like the large is a perfect fit for me, even with the included elbow armor here. The, the shoulders and back are sold separately. So 44 inches is kind of right between large and extra large. I'm saying this thing runs pretty true. If anything, round down a touch if you're between sizes and you should be dialed in. Now remember, you should buy your gear at speedaddicts.com because we're gonna offer you no cost returns. All you have to do is live in the lower 48 states and we make it real easy to get that uh, free return label to exchange or get a refund, whatever you need to do. Just make sure the gear's in the original packaging. You live in the lower 48 states, a couple clicks, you'll be all dialed in. Give us a shot on your next gear purchase and we'll definitely treat you like family. Okay, let's go back to the jacket here. Enough with my shameless plugs. You're seeing the flannel side. Flannel side is very straightforward. You're going to get that flannel casual look with two pockets here on the exterior. These are simple snap and uh, flat pockets. There's no zippers or anything like that in the chest area, but you also get two pockets down below. These have one snap, no zipper. You're gonna get venting underneath your armpit here, if you can see that, so you can get more ventilation. This is kind of a medium weight jacket, medium to heavier weight, as compared to that standard covert flannel which is a little bit lighter. So it's gonna give you more warmth than that because of the liner and just the weight. Now inside of the jacket itself, you are going to get abrasion resistance in those abrasion zones. The elbows, back and shoulders have 600 denier polyester at those points because as we all know, typical street garments will shred as soon as they hit that asphalt. I'm gonna flip this around real quick so you can see the armor pockets and the other goodies that are on the other side. So. Step one, rob the bank with the flannel side. As you're leaving and heading for the, your motorcycle, you're gonna flip this around and you're gonna get two looks. Hold on. <clears throat> you probably wanna unbutton the cuffs, it'll go faster and uh, increase your odds of getaway. Okay, <clears throat> here we go. Now here's the members only look and you're gone in the wind, okay? So this is what this looks like here. And then you get snaps and buttons. Let's see on this side. You probably won't do the snaps, you're just gonna do the zipper. So let's zip this up. Don't stop to zip it up, just keep running. Okay, here we go. Chest pocket right here on the polyester side, you get one chest pocket. And then on this internal, or on the, uh, the hand pockets, you do get zippers, which is nice. You don't have to worry about things. Falling out of those, you notice that the, uh, the armpit vents are double-sided zippers, so you can access those no matter which way the jacket is to get that ventilation. Now you're gonna see the little slots for the armor. So you are gonna get level one SAS armor for the elbows right out of the package. The shoulders and back sold separately, but you can see those pockets here. And when I turn around on the back. Now this other side, you're getting that quilted look, you're getting more uh, resistance from the wind penetration or the elements, um, if it get cut out in the rain, you can flip this around and get more protection there. Up on the top, on the collar, they did put little magnets in here that are supposed to hold your collar down, but uh, I'm not really seeing a lot of grab out. Oh, there they go. All right, so a little bit, they could be a touch stronger, but you can kind of feel that grabbing the magnet there. It's supposed to keep the collar from flapping around in the breeze. One year warranty on the Morpheus, Again, two jackets in one. You're going to get kind of a casual look 
with either the flannel or the members only look, but you got the armor pockets. You got the 600 denier polyester abrasion zones in the elbow, so more protection than your typical street garment. Now, if there's a question I didn't answer about the Morpheus jacket, don't worry. Briar Sports standing by over at speedaddicts.com. That's right, you can always talk to a human with us through the phone, email, or live chat. If you already got a Morpheus, let us know how you like it in the comment section below. Don't take my word for it. And I uh, appreciate y'all for watching. We'll see you next time to find out what's in the crate.